Hey guys, Zenkel Dev here, and today I'm going to show you how to access the LED flashlight on an iPhone Xcode. So, what we're going to do is open it up Xcode, go to File, New, New Project. We're going to make a single view application, we'll call it Flashlight Device iPhone. I'm going to put mine on my desktop. Once you've created the application, you want to go to build phases, link binary with libraries, and you want to go ahead and find the AV Foundation framework. And once you've done that, you want to go to view controller and you want to import the AV Foundation framework. So hashtag import AV Foundation will surely come up. So once you've done that, you want to go to viewcontroller.m and underneath the implementation, you want to put minus void set torch on colon parentheses ball parentheses is on curly bracket av capture device asterisk device equals square bracket av capture device default device media type av media type square bracket semicolon square bracket device lock for configuration nil semicolon square bracket device set torch mode is on question mark av capture torch mode on space colon av capture torch mode off square bracket semicolon square bracket device unlock or configuration square bracket semicolon and underneath the curly bracket you want to put minus ib action change state curly bracket ui switch Asterisk switch value equals parentheses UI switch asterisk sender semicolon square bracket self set torch on square bracket switch value is on square bracket square bracket semicolon so once you've done that, you should be able to build and receive no errors. Okay. So build succeeded. And once you've done that, you want to go to the main storyboard dot storyboard and find the UI switch. Drag it onto your view. And then you want to implement the method. So you want to go to underneath the view controller scene and tap on the view controller and then go to the last and um, the connections inspector on the um, little menu on the top and where it says receive actions and change state you want to drag the change state onto the button and then press on value changed once you've done that and also make sure the button state is off so we go to where the switch column and the state off so that's it, and now I will show you how how it's uh, featured on the real iPhone of the application working. Here is the flashlight app in use on an iPhone, and as we stated on the project, it comes off automatically when you start the application. So the back of the iPhone has no flashlight. However, if we turn it on, the flashlight is clearly visible so that's it guys thanks for watching if you enjoyed this tutorial please like favorite comment and subscribe this has been Sankal Dev and I'm out peace